Hey guys, so I just got my video camera in the mail and I'm really excited. This is what it, the box looks like. This is an HD digital video camera. Here's the box. So let's open it up and see what's inside. There we go. Oh, okay, so it comes, oh, that's so nice. It comes with the cable, so I'm going to up to a computer or a TV, looks like. That's awesome. This must be the camera itself. That's a pretty nice case. It's pretty solidly built, I would say. And then some other, this looks like, oh, it's a battery, okay. Oh, it comes with a spare battery, too. That's really nice. And then it looks like a charging cord. Yeah. Or actually, if that's the battery, I don't know if that's a charging cord. Hmm. Huh. Okay. So then we have the user's manual. There's a little business card in there, too. Okay. So I'm going to look at the camera. Let's sit down and look at the camera. Oh, I don't know. Okay. So I got this camera because I really want to shoot a couple of YouTube videos. And I'll try to put the links to the YouTube videos um, in this video description. There we go. Or this product description. So as you can see, it's got a nice... Um, got a nice handle. This is sewn in a really nice way. Um, it looks like it's going to be sturdy and last for a while. I don't know. That I'm going to look, I'm going to try putting the uh, batteries in. This is a very nice compact HD camera. Fits in the palm of my hand. And what I'm going to do is to take some video of the flowers that are blooming here. So to do that, first off, flip out this side cover. And as you can see, the welcome message comes up. And then to start recording, press the record button. So now we're recording, moving around just a little bit, and then moving off in the distance. And to zoom in on the camera, simply slide the zoom button. The camera uses an SD card for storage of media, and you can find these rather inexpensively. Uh, in this case, I'm using an SD adapter, which I use with my standard micro SD card. Insert your SD disk into your Windows-based computer. In this case, I'm using a SD to USB converter. The files that you just created will show up on your computer. You can select the one that you just created. And there it is. There's the video on the computer, which you can then upload to your YouTube channel. Once your video is uploaded to YouTube, you can play it on your smart TV, like I'm doing right now. Or you can also share the link with your friends around the world. This is an amazing compact camera that produces crisp, clear images, and I highly recommend it.